The N-1150 Assault Breacher Vehicle AV is a U.S. military mine and explosives clearing vehicle based on the M1 Abrams chassis, equipped with a mine, plow, and line charges. The M-1150 Assault Breacher Vehicle AV is a tracked armored engineer vehicle specifically designed for conducting in-stride breaching of minefields and complex obstacles. The AVV is built on the same chassis as the General Dynamics built M1, a 1 Abrams main battle tank. The Assault Breacher Vehicle AV is a single platform that will provide deliberate and in stride breaching capability to the assault force of the Marine Air Ground Task Force. The AV operates as part of the Combined Arms Task Force and is assigned to and employed by combat engineers. The AV incorporates a number of subsystems, including a full width mine plow, dual line charges, lane marking system remote control system, and protective weapon system. The integration of the breaching package onto the AVV, which uses the M1 tank chassis, shall require minimal modification to the chassis. The development and design of the AVV were carried out in the U.S. Army Anniston Depot in Alabama, who has extensive experience in the overhaul and modernization of armored fighting vehicles and other equipment. These tracked combat vehicles were especially designed to clear pathways for troops and other vehicles through minefields and along roadside bombs and improvised explosive devices. The 72-ton, 40-foot-long, 12-meters vehicles are based on the M1 Abrams with a 1,500-horsepower engine, but fitted with a 50-calories machine gun and a front-mounted 15-foot-wide 4.6-meters plow supported by metallic skis that glide on the dirt and armed with nearly 7,000 pounds, 3,200 kilograms of explosives. They are equipped with linear demolition charge system, LDCS rockets carrying C4 explosives up to 100 to 150 yards forward, detonating hidden bombs at a safe distance so that troops and vehicles can pass through safely. For its self-protection, the M1150 ABD is armed with 50 12.7 mm M2 HB machine gun. This machine gun is mounted to the Commander Cupola. A bank of standard electrically operated grenade launchers are fitted on either side of the superstructure to cover the frontal arc. The M1150 ABD is built on the same chassis as the General Dynamics, built M1 A1 Abrams main battle tank. The ABV will provide crew protection and vehicle survivability, while having the speed and mobility to keep pace with the maneuver force. For the AV roll, the turret of the M1A1 Abrams MBT has been removed and replaced by a new all-welded steel structure to which has been added the latest explosive reactive armor era package. This provides a higher level of protection against anti-tank weapons fitted with a high-explosive anti-tank heat warhead fitted to weapons such as the RPG-7 rocket-propelled grenade. The chassis used for these M1150 MBV were supplied from surplus army stocks and were refurbished to a common standard with a current M1 A1 Abrams MBT used by the U.S. Marine Corps. The suspension of the ABV is composed on each side with seven road wheels and two track return rollers on each side of the chassis. The drive sprocket is mounted at the rear and the idler at the front. ABV will fill the requirement to clear a lane of sufficient width and depth for the assault forces and will be operated by a two-man crew with an option for remote control. The M1150 ABV is equipped with a variety of specialized equipment supplied by the British company Pearson Engineering. For clearing minefields, the FWM full width mine plows can be swiftly installed at the front of the vehicle, which can be rapidly replaced by the CDB combat dozer units that, in addition to clearing boundary obstacles, can also be used to prepare firing positions.